Alright guys, today I'm going to be reviewing or testing this, um, it's a 20 amp, 24 volt, um, 7S, little, uh, BMS from AliExpress, so I got all my wires pretty much paralleled, so that way I can actually use this, um, go meter, and I can actually see my voltage here, so. 28.12 they're pretty well balanced 13 millivolt difference 91 percent total and it's got all the voltages from all of them so what i'm going to do is use the other side here to actually go ahead and monitor or not monitor but let's go ahead and charge this up using the actual bms now so obviously if you just send voltage directly to your batteries once the first one reaches 24 plus volts, it'll actually cut off. This is supposed to cut off at the correct voltage, so we'll test that if it does that. So we'll hook this up here. And um, we'll see how it goes. So put the positive lead on the positive side, and this of course will tell us kind of what it's doing in the background there. We got the voltmeter as well, in case we need it. So here we go. I'll leave it right here, that way you guys can get a good view of the so right away it's starting to get imbalanced because it's charging so here I'm not going to balance or do anything I'm just going to just monitor it So we'll also bump up the amperage here. As you can see this one right here we already got one cell that should be cutting off shortly just trying to see if there's anything hot This thing's actually a little warm. I don't I don't think we need this since we're able to just watch it on there. So this shows that it's actually fully charged because this number two battery is actually already ready. But it is still drawing an amp and a half. Five, there it is, two five. So at this point, this should cut off. And there it is, it's a 2.52 already. There we go, I think the BMS just started to balance them.
So I think we're pretty good for this test. Next thing we'll do is go ahead and try to drain it to see how the battery handles the drain. So that's all for now. Thanks for watching.